sight. This is the informer's house. I need to find apartment number five. use these boxes to receive mail. It was a very unreliable method. There was also something about pigeons. The elevator is broken. I will have to use the stairs. something heavy and try to break it off. had not changed, I would certainly disassemble this old car for its useful spare parts. However, I do not need this now. Besides, it would be irrational to use my cutter for this purpose. It would certainly damage the details.
can most likely break the pipe with the brick. It is one of those rare cases when brute force is more efficient than science. Looks like the police officers did not notice me. You won't believe it, but I saw it with my own eyes. A damn robot jacked the aero car. I just can't believe they could do such a thing. I mean, maybe it's some kind of power failure. Listen, turn off Jeff's auto updates, just in case. If this is some kind of bug, we better be on the safe side. There is nothing useful here. from a less civilized time. It most likely contains useful information, which could help me to find the data disk. to delete this mail, so no one will ever read it. The ammunition for this weapon has not been produced for many years, so it is completely useless. There is no point in disassembling it either, because it is too primitive to operate.
There is a secret safe deposit behind a painting. It is likely that the safe contains what I am searching for. I am stuck. I need to contact Gregory and decide what to do next. Hello, Gregory. I am on site. Describe the situation. Did you succeed in entering the informer's apartment? Yes, but I did not find F2. There is an airlock on the front door. It looks as though the police were here recently and searched the place. If they found the data, we are in trouble. The disk is probably still here. I found a secret safe that has not been opened by the police but I do not know how to open it. I will ask Nick to help you. What else did you find? I saw an unread message on the F2's intercom. It was received less than a day ago, most likely after the police visited the apartment. It says that the informer had an appointment in a place called The Core. The Core? Let me see. There is an abandoned bar with such name 12 kilometers away from where you are. If you do not find the disc here, you should go and check there. How do I crack a safe? Nick will connect to it using your intercom. Explore its security and tell you what to do. It is strange that the police did not open the safe during the search. It was hidden behind a painting. They probably just didn't find it. A secret safe? But how did you find it? I was looking at the painting when I noticed that it can be opened. It is curious that you noticed that. Robots usually do not pay attention to pieces of art. That is probably why the police officers could not locate the safe. Okay, I am giving you Nick. Report when you find anything. Over. Hello, RT. Put your intercom closer to the safe so I can connect to it. All right. The safe is next to me. Good. I am launching a connection. Connected. The safe is old-fashioned. I already found information about a security vulnerability of this model on the internet. We need a factory reset. Done. The safe has just generated a new password. I intercepted the password, but it is encrypted. What do we do? It uses cryptographic protection, which cannot be hacked remotely. I will write you a password guessing program. Swap the elements on the safe screen and use the hints on the intercom panel. Ready. You can start now. RT, I am cutting the connection. Someone is trying to intercept our signal. We must go radio silent for a few hours. You have got everything you need to crack the safe. Over. I have never cracked anything. Now I can only count on myself.
As I expected, there is no data disk inside, but it seems that I found the key that is referred to in the letter. I have to take a risk and go to a bar called The Core, where I will probably find something of use. I should go. I will not find anything else here. nailed down in this building.
is this table reserved? There's plenty of seating space. satisfactory sound quality.
It is a weird place. It does not look abandoned to me. Someone was here recently. Were they humans? A food cooking station. Based on the amount of dirty dishes left behind, it appears that humans stayed here for a long time. Apparently, they ran out of doors. What is it? Why would the humans need bottled water? There is a sink in the basement, and the plumbing here works fine. It appears someone was sick and medical care was dispensed. I read that humans had very efficient abilities to regenerate and heal, but they heavily relied on drugs to assist in this process. Preserved food. If it is not damaged, its vacuum sealed contents can be nutritious for decades. This particular canned food has a short expiration date. Temperature level and organic residue indicates that somebody cooked food here recently. I estimate it was less than 24 hours ago. F2, I could not contact you and I moved everyone to another place. Who are you? What are you doing here? I am RT217NP. And you? TR2-5201, Fletcher. How did you find this place? F2 was supposed to bring us some important data, but we lost contact. He was probably exposed. I have been instructed to find the data. Is F2 arrested? How did they figure him out? How did you find out about this place? We don't know what happened to F2. I entered his apartment and read the message on the intercom. The message mentioned the core, and we supposed it was this bar. That means the police knows about this place as well. I suppose no one saw the message but me. I deleted it after reading. So we are on the same side and you help humans? How many of you are there? That is correct. There are five of us. I thought we were the only ones who know the truth. Nobody knows the whole truth. But you are not the only ones helping humans. We need to join forces. How many humans did you save? None. The humans that we were supposed to meet died in a shuttle crash during the transfer. I am sorry. We must join as soon as possible and transfer all humans into a safe place in order to avoid such accidents in the future. I agree. What should we do? F2 provided me some important information, which he apparently was going to give you as well. I need to meet your leader. Is that your aero car outside? Yes. You need to see Gregory. I can take you to our shelter. How many are in your group? Seven humans, five adults, and two children. Where are they now? They are in a shelter in the city. We move constantly to avoid detection. USS found our other two shelters. But thanks to F2, we escaped before the police arrived. Do you know anything about other groups of humans? We know that there are several isolated groups. We need to contact them. Otherwise, they will be tracked down sooner or later. I saw a police officer seizing a human in a supermarket today. Fortunately, I could interfere and save him. He should bring his group in an appointed place this evening. 
We have to act secretly, because there are just a few robots who know the truth, and they are all wanted by the police. We must ensure their security. It is hard to hide a group of humans and supply it with whatever is required. We cannot bring them all here, because it is easy to locate a building full of humans. RT told me that F2 turned over some data to you. Can it help us? Exactly. While working with the police archives, F2 discovered information about an abandoned underground research lab. It has been shut down since the humans left. It is a perfect shelter. We could accommodate everyone there, even the ones we have yet to find. Police would not search for the place because it is outside of the city limits. Is it safe to trust the information from the police archives? Yes, it was not of interest to the USS and has not been analyzed. F2 deleted the data after he copied it, so no one will ever know about it. That is great news. We need the coordinates and then we can start preparing the lab for humans. There are two issues. First, the exact coordinates are unknown. Because there are jamming devices in the woods, we must first track them down and disable them. Second, we do not know what is in the lab. We must check it for safety and then restore the power and water supply. I see. You did very well, RT. I think you can solve these problems and prepare the lab. I need you to do your best because human lives depend on it. Good. Where do I begin? First, search the location for jamming devices. We do not know how they look and how hard it is to disable them. There is no signal there, so you can count only on yourself. After you disable the jammers, we will determine the exact coordinates of the lab by its energy signature. RT, use an arrow car to disable the jammers as soon as you can and take control of the lab. Fletcher and I will coordinate the transfer. We have 18 hours left. Charge yourself and go. The lab must be ready by this evening. Copy that. Heading out.
this drone has almost destroyed me. This must have been a very outdated model, because if it were a modern police drone, my chances of survival against it without any weapon would be minimal. Why was this aero car abandoned in the woods? It is quite difficult to walk to the city from here. Now that this device is deactivated, all that is left to do is to find and deactivate the second one. Need to return to the arrow car.
the second jamming device is deactivated. Now we can figure out the location of the laboratory. I need to contact Nick. RT, do you copy? Nick, I can hear you. After I disabled the second jammer, the communication has been re-established. That is great. You were silent for a long time. Is everything all right? Yes, it is. Despite the guide drones who tried to destroy me, their lack of mobility can probably be explained by old-fashioned technology. We didn't know about any security drones. Be careful. Can we locate the lab now? Yes, we can locate any electronics within 10 kilometers. I can see your own signal, the arrow car, two jammers. Got it. A huge object to the northwest from you must be the lab. I am forwarding you the coordinates. Find a way to get inside. Copy that. at the destination, but there is nothing here. I need to look around. In the past, humans often used wood as a building material. It is a renewable resource, but humans used it unwisely. He only had a plastic keycard. Maybe I can get into the laboratory with it. He probably died a few decades ago. The key card fits the slot, but nothing happens. Evidently, the panel is no longer powered. I need to ask Nick for help. Hello, Nick. I seem to have found the entrance. I have a key card, but the access panel is disabled, so I cannot come in. The lab has probably been de-energized after the shutdown, but there must be a way to activate the panel manually. There is a detector in your intercom which allows you to find energy hubs. Just turn it on. Try to determine where the electric channels go, and that is how you can find a way to restore the power supply. Let me try. Yes, you are correct. I can see an energy channel going underground. Thank you for the information. I need to check the branches of the energy channel.
The laboratory is definitely somewhere nearby. Otherwise, we're I need to restore the power first. I have already spoken with Nick. The access panel is active now. <laughs> 